Lisa Kaylock and I'm teaching you uh, modern class today. Um, I have really no idea what your level is um, and unfortunately I can't give you corrections. Um, some of it might be new, some of it might be too easy. Just modify it to your level. If something is too easy, you can always add a rally or a turn. Alright, so we're going to start with a warm up on uh, laying down on the floor and you can just follow me, it's nice and slow. We're going to start on our backs, hugging the knees into the chest. Let's make sure that the back of the neck is nice and long. You want to relax your shoulders into the floor. And you can close your eyes for this and just take a moment to tune into your body. Take a nice deep breath and on an exhale you want to hiss as loud as you can. Um, do it on your own time and we're going to do about three of them. Here we go. And as you push all the air out you feel your body relaxes just a little bit deeper into this pose. Keep going on your time. Place one hand on each knee and slowly circle your knees. Try to let the arms do all the work so you can really relax in those hip sockets. Push down, look. Draw 
stretch the right hip up to the ceiling. And then the left. And come a little higher. Maybe add that all the way right here. Lower your heels if you're lifted and slowly down. And then bring your arms down towards your feet and lift your chest. Just want to make sure your tummy is nice and flat. You want to scoop it this way and this way. So you could set a ball in there if you wish. And you're going to do small little bounces. They happen because I'm contracting my abs. I do not want to use my shoulders, I want to use my abdominals. And here we go. Release a little bit and tighten. Release. Tighten. Release. And tighten. Release. You're going to twist over to the right. Tighten. Release. And tighten. Release. Release. Four. Over to the back. Here we go. And tighten. Release. And tighten. Release. And tighten. Release. One more. And tighten. Release. Hands behind the neck. We go to circle. Come up as high as you can. stretch and bring your arms back swivel around and let's do the other side right arm back left arm front open that left side good bring your arms back knee underneath your shoulders open your right leg reach on those toes and let the body follow over So I want to get my little toe on the floor. I want to bring the leg forward enough so it matches my personal side. And then I want to sink into this stretch. Shoulders are pulled into the torso and neck is nice and relaxed. Not only want to stretch your left side, you want to lengthen through your right side as well. Nice deep breath here. And then we slowly circle. Two 
more. Go as far back as you can, right to the edge of falling over. We want to increase that upper body flexibility. As you get here, you want to twist. Left hand on the outside of the right foot, right hand on the back. Okay. 
two play, two play in one, two, come all the way up, roll away, seven and eight, and then we're gonna go with the second position, same thing. All right, here we go with music. second position. in your right Four 
goes down. Six, seven, eight. We'll come flex. One, two, three, four, seven, six, seven, eight. Back, two, three. Last one. Here we go. Hold. So I want to bend my knee, I want to go four starch, one, two, three, I hit that, half point, four, and then reach, six, and then a plie, again, your half point, eight, one, two, three, four, five, plie, six, and I want to hold on nice and tight to my left leg, I'm going to circle my arm, and I open my right leg into a first position, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, half point, and down, and a reach. Close, out, 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 plie. So now I'm going to do the same thing with my left leg. Always the leg that the detente use will be the one that changes direction. I'll circle my arm, then I come into a parallel position. So now I'm facing the other diagonal. So we're going to go parallel side. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Reach. Let that knee float as you come in. Tongue. Side. One. One. Third one. Plie. Sit it with my right leg. My right leg opens. And I'll be in first position. Facing the next corner. And one, two, three. Four, reach and knee floats and a half point and down. One, slow, quick, quick, quick. Plie left leg in. Two, back. Two, three, four, reach and lift the knee and back. In, back, back, back. Plie open. The first, and we go turn up to the back, reach, lift, bring it in one slow, quick, 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 plie and parallel two. So that gets us all the way around. Then we're going to add some swings. So, something to think about for your swings it's really a lift through your abdominals, and we want to avoid the drop of the shoulders. So I want to lift my abdominals, and I'm going to come back up. Then I want to go again, and I open my right arm, twisting. I'm trying to avoid moving my knees so that I'm really getting that upper body flexibility. And up, we're going to repeat that. Swing, and one, open, here we go. Then we're going to go swing, first, swing, parallel. Swing, lift, and then ready to do the left. So I will repeat the swings. So you're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, and ready for the left. So you can look at the demonstration as many times as you need. I would like to do it with you now with the music. Here we go. Give it a good stretch. 
I reach out as far as I can. since we cannot really travel across the floor. I'm specially doing this so you can do this in a limited amount of space, whatever you have. And I hope you have a good sweat by now. I sure do. All right, so here we go. We're starting first position. We wanna go twist. And again, I don't wanna let my hips twist. I wanna hold on tight because I wanna really increase my upper body flexibility. So this is on the one. Then you wanna lift up. Make sure that you lift your abdominals around your arms come to the center and stretch and let me take a little porter bra to the back and a seven and eight other side one lift and curve three four back six seven eight we're going to take a groan two three four and then we extend the right leg to the front seven eight turn in Turn out and a touch and a close and then a passe and a rollery and then back to the first other side one two we're gonna speed this up a little bit back six seven eight one you'll hear a nice downbeat when that one is come around and do the back of two grand plie same with the left leg turn it in turn it out make sure you touch and then you drag it in up rollery down to the second twist curve same thing here so you want to extend your leg to the side turn it in turn it out but then you want to bring it to the first position so the passe always happens from the first to the first other side same thing then we finish back in first we go to the fifth right plie round back other side around back then we want to do the grand plie we want to extend to the back and then bring it to the first, passe, rollery, down and two. And then the left foot comes front, twist, down. All right, let's give it a shot with the music. Here we go, please. I might mark some of this, um, but you go for it. You gotta count slow. Five, six, seven.
combination. I will break it down for you, but just let it happen once it's in your body. Um, it doesn't need to look exactly how I am doing. Um, just let the music take you. All right, so it, the music has like dum, and then dum, dum, and then dum, dum. It has four of these. We cannot hit the first one because it comes so fast. On the second one, it's completely up to you. Just give me a sharp movement. It's kind of like walking, so I don't know. Dum, 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 dum. Whatever you feel like. And then the beat comes in. So you want to let your right leg go to the side and your arm circles. Two, three, four. And then I want to turn on my right leg and open my right arm. And then come back and then hip circle. Seven, eight. So you can just rewind until you got it. So your next eight, um, we just came around from the hip circle. You want to go parallel posse, one, two. So I'm lifting my hip, two, and I step out three, and then I'm going to hit with my hip on four, and then a rib circle, six, seven, eight. Your next eight, so you just come <clears throat> from your rib circle, seven, eight. You're going to hit a turn, and you're going to face over that way to my right side. And I want to get my leg to the back. So turn, leg to the back, four. Then again, you want to have one hit, five. And then slow down, six, seven, eight. We're going to go into a plank, one, two. Then you want to lift all your fours off the floor, three, four. Look at five, six, turn this one in, seven, eight. We're gonna go fingers on the floor, one, two, three, four. I gotta cross my legs as I do a little handstand, six, seven, seven, eight. Then it goes back to the sound, anything you want, boom, boom, dum, dum, wing, wing, boom. Then we have a little extension, two, three, four, five, six, and then you want to brush it back behind you, seven, eight, hips, two, ribs, two, hand, six, seven, eight. All right, so practice those eights, and then when you have it in the body, uh, let's give it a shot in music. I'm going to show you what it looks on my body, but it might look very different on yours. All right, here we go. <laughs> 